How's it going, everybody? Noel here from Clintard Collectibles. Today, we're going to be recording a uh, Locals recap video from a couple of weeks back. Uh, I've been really sick lately. I talked about it in the previous video, but I've been really sick. I just haven't had time. I just needed to rest and stuff like that. And every time I would talk for too long, I'd like get nauseous and almost throw up. And just like it hurt to talk because my throat was so scratchy. But today, we got another Locals recap with the virtual world. I'm still running it, still playing it. And, um, yeah, so we're going to go over what my matches were. Uh, my matches started off, I had to play against Floranderese round one. I got 2 0 by Floranderese. Um, it, it really sucks when they lock you out of your, your special summons, so that kind of sucked. But, you know, I, I tried to side uh, for it, but I just, I, I just had a hard time dealing with it. So I don't know. Uh, in round two, I had to play against um, Sword Soul. Which I actually did decent against, um, slowly learning how to side against it and stuff, but uh, it, it just still like kind of uh, overpowered me. Uh, round three, I had to play against Pendulum Magicians, which I won that game uh, 2-0, pretty clean. Um, kind of went second game two and attacked over one of his things and made Zeus and kind of sat on it, and he didn't really have any. He couldn't really do anything about it, um, and then. Round four, I played against Salamangrate, and it went to game three. It was really close, but I just, um, he just pulled out the W. He actually score talkered me. So, I mean, fair and square, he got me. I, I didn't have anything to stop it, so he got me. But, uh, yeah, let's go over the deck list. Um, right now, we're running Triple Lulu. She's your main combo piece for the monsters because uh, she lets you send one to grave, add the hand. Uh, triple Lao Lao, uh, he lets you dis uh, send one and then uh, special summon one from your graveyard. Three Lili, she lets you send three to your, or two cards to your graveyard. GG lets you send one to your graveyard especially, and then at the end of the turn add a virtual world from your graveyard to hand. Nyan Nyan, um, the main thing you can do with this one is either normal summon it, uh, just for that summon, or... Once it's in the graveyard and you use it to synchro off or whatever, you can like use Lala, bring back a level like a Lulu, and then bring back Nyan Nyan and Overlay or something like that. You can do different things depending on what you need, but um, you can bring Nyan Nyan back, and then when she gets banished, you can shuffle one of your banished virtual world cards back to your deck. So pretty good. Uh, triple Ash and Triple Nibiru and one Veiler. So uh, Ash just to stop other people from getting advantage, Nibiru. For the board wipe, Nibiru is really strong this this format. And Valor. Those are the monsters. I'm so used to talking about this deck list. Um, that, uh, yeah, I just know exactly what to talk about with it. Definitely going to be editing it a little bit today. All right. Spells, we got Triple Quinlong. Let you banish it from graveyard to special one from, uh, add one from deck to hand. Kowloon lets you activate a gate card right from your deck. So you can activate like Truche from deck. Uh, triple Pot of Desires, because we don't care about banishing stuff. Double e Telly. We got one Foolish Burial Goods to send stuff to, like Quinlong to grave. Call by the Grave, really strong card. You should definitely always be playing one of that in my opinion. For traps, we are running double chuche. Really good because if you set it to grave with like one of the cards, you can banish it to adjust the levels of one of your virtual worlds by three, basically. Um, Jean Wu lets you banish from grave to special one. And triple imperm. I just feel like it's really good. Unless you can get them effects. So yeah, that's the main deck. Uh, let's go into the extra and then we'll go into the side. All right, extra deck. We are looking at Invoked Kaliga, Breaksword, Ptolemy, Utopia Beyond, Thunder Charger, Zeus, Muddy Mud Dragon, Ultimaya Tzolkin, Coral Dragon, Quick, uh, Crystal Wing Synchro Dragon, Stars Charger Warrior, Vermilion Dragon Mech, Richard World Shen Chen, uh, No Thung, 
and GG. So, um, your main goal is to get Ultimai out, to get Crystal Wing out, and then kind of like, you can try, if you can do the extra steps, to go into Mud Dragon, and then Mud Dragon, and Giselle can fuse into Kaliga, so that way they can only activate one monster effect that turn, and then you can negate that monster effect with Crystal Wing. So it's really good and really strong. Uh, th this deck just has so many combo trees, so it's really easy to get lost in what you're doing. And depending on what scenario, you know, the basic path that you, you know, try to go on isn't always the best. Uh, side deck, we got a Pinker Tops. We got a Phantasme. I have this in here because a lot of people in my locals play Cell Mangrate, so I can just bring them out. Uh, Double Droll. Triple Lancia. A Harpy's Feather Duster, good going uh, second card. Lightning Storm, good going second card. Chalice. Double Cyclone. Solemn Strike, Solemn Warning, uh, but um, I put these in here for uh, Nibiru and Red Reboot. Yeah, so that's the Virtual World deck. Um, one of the things I'm thinking about doing is adding uh, DPE, the DPE engine in here. The issue is, is that I don't have enough fusion destinies or whatever to run three fusion destinies. And so I need like a Verte and I don't have Verte. So after Christmas and everything, uh, probably just buy one for my locals or order one or something if it doesn't get banned. Just so I can run the DPE package in this deck because it'll probably help it exponentially. And yeah, so I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Um, I'm gonna probably edit this deck immediately after this. I think I'll add Small World. I think I'll add some small world and take out Ooh, i knocked over some cards off camera um probably take out something like i don't know it's just it's really hard i've been thinking about taking out an ash just because ash isn't as good this format so i run like two ash yeah I run like double ash or something and then run a small world but um yeah so i hope you guys enjoyed the video um, I'll see you guys in the next video. So I really appreciate your guys' support. Shout out again to Volt for for supporting the channel. Thank you guys for all the new subscribers. You guys have really been uh, making this year fun, making videos. Um, I know we're not like a huge, massive channel, but I think that's a part of the appeal. And I really, really appreciate you guys coming and liking the videos and subscribing and commenting and giving us support. Uh, it really means a lot. So. Uh, yeah, can't wait to make more content for you guys next year. I'm going to try to keep uploading another couple of videos until the 31st and then start January 2022 off uh, with a bang, hopefully. So got some cool challenges to do with Austin in mind. Got some cool stuff coming. And uh, yeah, just if you guys uh, have any other recommendations on videos, I know um, Volt wanted to see my collection binder and we're going to go over that soon. And yeah, so thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.